The D21 starter is finally D21, in. D21, That's what we doing over here. Alright guys, so I'm leaving O'Reilly's right now. I just got a brand new starter for the truck because this star decided to give out. So just picked up the new starter from O'Reilly's and now we're gonna head home. Two hours later. Alright. So what is popping everybody? Mario here, welcome back to the channel. Quick little thing. I'm gonna start by taking this wheel off right here. And I believe if I jack it up, I should see like a little insert underneath there that I could get to the starter. There should be two bolts and it should come out easy. But you know, these old cars, there's always something. So I'm not even gonna talk a lot. I'm gonna set you guys up on a time lapse and I'm gonna try to get the starter out and throw the new one in. Okay, so. My battery is almost dead, so I gotta improvise at this point. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna like take quick snip snippets and give you guys like updates whenever I get something done. So like for right now, I just got the wheel off and um, I'm gonna show you guys like where the starter is. All right, so once you get the wheel off, I believe it's a 21. The starter is tucked right there and I believe there's a bolt. Let me get the flash on for you guys. All right, there we go, the flash is on. The starter is actually right there. That big old thing right there, shit's rusty. But I believe there's a bolt right there, one at the bottom, and there should be another one at the top if I'm not mistaken. But I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna grab that old one out and we'll put that new one right in. Yeah. Oh shit. My dumbass, this shit's still alive. Okay, so that sucker is stuck down there. I gotta get the negative and the positive off of it. So I'm gonna disconnect those from the back and then drop this shit down. I got the old starter up. I'm about to put the new starter in right now. I'm gonna mock up the new one next to it to see if it's the same thing. Make sure that everything is the same because they tend to up a lot when it comes to the terminals right here so i'm gonna check the terminals to make sure they're horizontal and not vertical so yeah take this joke i hate working on old vehicles because of this very reason but they look identical pretty much the same so i guess it should work perfect i'm gonna throw this shit in i'm not even gonna waste any time i'm just throw this shit in and Make sure it works and call it a day. Hopefully everything goes as planned. So your boy's about to throw this shit in and hopefully all goes well. I also ran into another small little problem, but I'm gonna show you guys that right now. Make sure you don't got no corrosion on your battery terminals. Cause yeah, the whole shit broke right off. So I'm about to replace the terminals. Also, put a new battery in here. So I already got the new battery and the new terminal. So I'm gonna throw the starter in and then I'm gonna tack that. So this is how I've always done it. I usually just climb underneath the car and just try to fit it in from like where the transmission is right here. I tuck it right here by the tie rod and the transmission, slide it in. It's kind of tight, but I just force it in there. So I got one bolt and I'm about to put a second one in and then I'm gonna fix the battery. I don't know if you could really see. Yeah, the starter is in, it's right there. Just gotta connect the terminals and then we should be good. So I got the old battery out with all that corrosion and shit, the old terminal off. Everything looked janked as but the new terminal is on. All this stuff is tightened. New battery is in. The new starter is in. Tucked on the deer, the wheel is on. Now let's see if it will start. Clutch. Oof. 
One click, bro. One click. Now that she's on, just gotta put this on so that she can start idling better. Never yes. seen what hood, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> the D21 starter is finally the D21 in. D21, That's what we doing over here. He, yo, he was here all the time. He don't even know what we just did. What we just did, yo. Man, put that, put that starter. You know. We uh. just, <laughs> you did it by your hands clean as hell. Yeah, hands clean, fit clean. Man. Got it here. <laughs> you just got the starter, and you feel me? The battery terminals, all that shit is good. I just gotta clean up all of this shit. Yeah, you just gotta get all this shit out of here. Shit. Shut the f up. Get that shit out of here. <laughs> Take this off. Um, this Yo, matter of fact, now, you, matter of fact, I'm gonna make this video a little bit more interesting. <laughs> no, we not. I think Lawrence could take this truck out of the garage. <laughs> it's like, it's like I still gotta teach him. All right, you, if you stall, that's even worse though. Shit, that's what we recording. Wait a minute, we started? Huh? Yeah, started. Yeah, like, I know how to start it. <laughs> Watch him try to start it and can't start it. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Everything is finally done. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope some of you find it interesting or helpful in some way. Before, like, I even did this, I looked up starter videos and I couldn't find any. I had to figure it out myself. So, hopefully, some of you guys find this video helpful and if you did give this video a fat thumbs up and i'm gonna holla at you in the next one so you about to drive a truck out or not